It is 7.06, right on the nose, Central Standard Time, and I am live from the Infowars.com studios in Austin, Texas, and we have got a four-hour four hour original transmission coming up tonight, including a documentary dissertation, Joel Skousen and myself with Strategic Relocation, the film, and what is it, a two-hour show? Now, I'm very excited and I'm very honored that tens of thousands of you tune in at the start of the show every night and, I don't know, 50,000 or so end up watching it uh, every evening and then millions every week once it goes to YouTube and other places watch it and hundreds of thousands download the uh, MP4s we post at PrisonPlanet.tv. But I, I'm not telling you these numbers bragging. We reach 15 million people every week on the AM and FM radio and satellite and the rest of it, XM, which is huge. What is unbelievable uh, is that the TV system we're building and all the beta testing we're doing the last year and a few months, 16 months or so, is really coming together by the grace of God. Uh, you build it, they will come. And I want to give you some good news. Uh, you know, not this last Bilderberg, but the Bilderberg before last hit the zeitgeist. Three and a half million views on Justin TV alone on a channel we never even use count the other live stream things. So we can't pay for our own bandwidth. That's why we have subscriptions is that you're, you're literally paying the cost that, you know, to get you the high def uh, downloads and the uh, decent quality streams. So I'm just kind of giving you a state of the info war here for prisonplanet.tv and the nightly news before we go to this huge piece that we just finished minutes before I went live. That's why some nights I do a little bit of live before we show you the tape to air show. And some nights now we go live, period, with all the different packages we've put together because we're just gauging everything before we create that one hour power packed uh, transmission. And so that is what we're doing here. And all of you that are PrisonPlanet.tv members, uh, it's because you were able to do this. Now, one PrisonPlanet.tv membership is $5.95 a month. If you get a yearly membership, you get a couple months free. But before I had it where three people could use the same username and passcode, so it was five ninety five for three memberships a month. Then I boosted it up to six as our servers got bigger and better and better backup systems because the site's had a few hiccups over the years, nine and a half years. Now we've got it running well enough that I am now announcing one five ninety five a month membership is now going to be ten memberships. That is fifty nine cents a month per membership. Uh, we're talking about what six dollars? What does that come to? If it's if it's if it's if it's, if it's five ninety five a month, and you get ten of those, that's fifty nine cents. What's twelve times fifty nine cents? I'm public school educated, folks. Help me. The point is, uh, you're talking about twelve dollars or something. I'm off the top of my head. Um, no, no, no. It's got to be more than that. 12 times 59 cents is $7 and something cents. Well, okay, whatever. The point is, because I just announced this on air today, I said, you know what, our servers can handle it, and, and, and PrisonPlanet.tv is paying for itself. One membership, when you get some banners for this, I've told the crew this, the, the great uh, graphics people, we need to explain. One membership is now 10 memberships. And all you got to do is create a username and passcode that is not repeat not your bank codes, obviously. People said, well, how am I going to give this away? My, 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 my password for PrisonPlanet.tv is my regular code. Create a new code, a, you know, a, a silly code and a silly username, and then send out to 10 friends and family, hey, here's your gift subscription to hard-hitting InfoWarsNews.com. If PrisonPlanet.tv scares them, InfoWarsNews.com will get in there and say, all these films, if they're Democrats, we got films about the Republicans. If they're if they're uh, Republicans, we got the Obama deception. It all exposes its control, but get them to watch it, get them to wake up, because what I want is hearts and minds. What I want is to wake people up. There's many documentaries. There's 25 of my films. There's dozens of other films we've been authorized to post, about the North American Union, Camp FEMA, <clears throat> Don't Tread on Me, um, the Police State for the Rise of FEMA, and tonight we're going to premiere and stream Strategic Relocation the Film, breaking down the globalist master plan to try to sneak attack this country and how to protect yourself. So uh, there's nine and a half years of material. I've been on air 17 years. A lot of the material pre-PrisonPlanet.tv is there. Get a PrisonPlanet.tv membership today to fight the prison planet and get your Christmas shopping done early. Put the username, passcode, and a card. Say this is an amazing subscription site. 
All you do is put this username and passcode in. That's whatever you make. And, and, and if you already have a code that you don't want people to know, you can, you can go do a procedure that's real easy to change your username passcode. Or go get another stinking membership, $5.95 a month, you know, sign up for another year and, and, and get even more discounts, and then have that as the other account you give people. That way you've got your account and if your friends and neighbors share the other account, because when 10 people do log in it simultaneously, it will uh, block you out. So keep your membership you've got now, go get the other membership and share that with people. Because here's the deal. Four or five times a year, we will have free streams for a day or so of PrisonPlanet.tv on election night or if some big event happens. And the bills have been $16,000 before, especially one time when I went two or three days uh, because hundreds of thousands tuned in. Guess what happened? And I was, I was showing the reports yesterday. Guess how many people watched on one day Election day, November 6th, through to the next morning. 24 hour spell, 230 something thousand. In fact, they, they were showing me the reports this morning. That's people that logged in and watched it. Okay, folks, you're like, well, Alex, you just said you have millions of listeners every day. What's the big deal? That's something that took me 17 years to do. And by the grace of God, getting on AM and FM stations and building, this is something where without even putting this on cable and satellite yet, which we're getting ready to do, the average MSNBC show has 200,000 viewers. The average CNN show has got about 300,000. The average Fox, about a million. Do you understand how fundamental it is that we could have over a three-day period, three and a half million viewers on Justin TV? Go look at the channel. It's like four million now because we never even use it. It was like a hundred thousand on there from us using it in a few tests. We did it three point five mil. And again, I'm not bragging. Look at our big audience. These are people we're reaching. This is exciting. We can beat these people when we engage them. I mean, it's like blowing up a Death Star on the X-wing. There's like ten more Death Stars to blow up, but we've proven we can blow these things up. Why do you think I came out with this that we sell at cost? We have subscriptions for $59.95, shipping included. More than half the cost of $59.95 is 12 of these in the little envelope and the sticker and the shipping and handling. Why do I sell these at cost? Because it's, it's what I really want is the hearts and minds. And imagine you give friends, family, the police station, the uh, local Masonic Lodge, the local uh, Jewish synagogue, the Catholic Church, the Seventh-day Adventists, the, the Muslims, whatever it is, the, the library, you give them a subscription for $59.95 and physically, look at this, physically, and we put some of these out free in Austin as a test. People just grab them up next to the other. And imagine, you're walking along seeing the regular problem. You see the secret life of zombies, Infowars.com. What's going to happen? You're going to pick this up. Look at, look at that. He's, he's getting one over there. Uh, and uh, <laughs> that's when we did a little point about how people are actually going into zombie-like state. And it's a giant color magazine with cartoons, crossword puzzles, factoids, new world order information. <clears throat> all right there. You can also buy them in 10 packs, 20 packs, up to 50 packs and 100 packs. And then give them to people. You want something to stocking stuff? You want something to give to friends? You want something to take to church? It's like a big color book. Got a big poster in the middle. Romney, Obama, either way, your vote counts. I mean, this is the type of stuff we're doing in here. I mean, this is a power-packed piece of material. And it, it, it's getting bigger. It's 60 pages long now. And you go to prisonplanet.tv and subscribe. You support us. But you also get something to pay forward. You know, 10 memberships for the price of one. It's all about you getting others to wake up. You... Um, Oh, there's just so many things you can do. You, 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 you get them in bulk at cost and hand them out at work in places or church. You, 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 you give people subscriptions and then 12, and we do have back issues sometimes left. So the first issue, we'll send them a couple copies when supplies last, which they are right now. We sold out of the first issue, not the last two. We almost have sold out of the, of the second one now. The point is, while supplies last, they'll get a couple the first time, and then each month, more. Imagine, 12 of these... You put their address in when you order the magazine, you know, where you want it mailed, and then boom, 12 of these, 12 of these, 12, 12, 12. I mean, that is a cool weapon right there. 12 on different topics coming 
to their door. And you can tell them or not tell them. And, you, and a lot of people donate to their local libraries. Well, that's what you do. You just They just know. It comes in. People know. And boom. Oh, well, here, let's just put that in the magazine rack. Oh, oh, let's just put that right over here at the local library. <laughs> I mean, I mean <laughs> you've got to care about reaching out to people, and we'll kick these globalist butts. And again, they're still busy editing and just putting together the monster monster transmission that we put together tonight. Mike Adams coming up. He's got two guests, including Steve Quayle. And who was the other one? Joe Nobody. Uh, and I, I, did, I missed that part because I was busy, but I'm sure that's an interesting interview. The point is, then we've got Melissa Melton on the aspartame and stuff and almost all the candy and, 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 and uh, even non-sugar-free you know, gums and how it's killing people. Uh, we've got... Um, Oh, the key big report tonight on guns and the fact that people are in denial that they're announcing they physically want to ban all semi-autos and make you turn them in, even though Diane Feinstein's saying it. And this wild callers I had today saying I was making it all up. So we went and put all the proof together for them. Yes, the government is coming after your guns. Uh, so there is that report coming up, all this and more tonight. Strategic relocation is over two hours long, ladies and gentlemen, and it's powerful. And that's coming up at the end of the show, the end of the transmission. That's why we're not rolling all this yet, because they're busy trying to still get all that lined up and ready. And so, if you have a membership and you're watching right now, did you give it to friends and family? Do you ever try to go log in and, and, and it says too many are logged in? Well, it's time to get another membership. But most of you probably never even shared your username passcode, did you? Well, tonight's the night. Because I, I, I told Max to turn it up to 10. Did they do that? They did? Okay, I, told, I had the idea today on air. We've turned it up to 10. I asked like a year ago, I said, can we turn this up to 10? They said, that's not a good idea. <laughs> we can barely keep this thing going. Now we've got the servers, and things have been working a lot smoother. I'd say, what, about 98% of the time they're really doing good. Thanks to all your support, we're tweaking it, grassroots building it. Go and give, you know, if it's username and passcode that's just for PrisonPlanet.tv, call your friends, call your neighbors, call your family and say, listen, they got proof of the plan to ban guns coming up on this channel tonight. Here's a special code to be able to watch it. Hey, they're going to expose that every major gun at the convenience store, gas station, drug store, store we went to, every major one, from Target to HEB, you cannot find regular gum. My kids don't get gum. We have to order it online, Beeman's and stuff. Everything has aspartame, all of it. Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to break down all the mainline studies, even new ones saying it makes you obese, brain damage you, liver failure, everything. And people are feeding us their kids all day. And now it's showing up in candy bars. It's not just in the mints. I mean, it is just absolutely everywhere. And you can go to the National Institutes of Health. This is a uh, this is a chemical warfare operation. Most of these idiot companies don't even know it. I mean, because they just trust the government, a bunch of eugenicists that want to reduce our population, done all the secret experiments on us. Warn people, care to tell people. I want to go do the gun show. Or I was thinking about burning this. Because people won't listen. I'm just holding it up and showing them documents. If I went and burned it. You know, th it, it, people would pay attention or better yet shot it with 50 cals. So we'll have to do that, like where I attack it with machetes, attack it with sledgehammers. I could dress in a gorilla suit and go and beat on it. I mean, you got to, yeah, anything so your kids don't, you know, die from this. Rob, how long you want me to keep rolling here? 25 more minutes. All right. Uh, just five. News in there. Red five standing by. With those headphones, the way he's got that on in that cap, it almost looks like, you know, he's one of the rebel guys and one of the Y-wings about to get blown up. Oh, man. So, um, you know, my kids have been calling me right before I went on air. And they said, Daddy, please come home. You come home late all the time. Please come home. Please come home. Please come home and play board games with us. And I said, I'm coming home right now. And then Deuce said, I, I'm not going to have this ready on time. And I thought, you know, we've got tens of thousands of people watching right now. I respect them enough that I'm going to be here. Because my children have no future. Your children have no future if we don't turn this around. And we've been able to build this so far thanks to you taking action and voting with your dollars. Sure, the electronic voting machines have been proven to be a total fraud. They called the election before most states even counted any of the day's votes. 
Uh, Prop 37, obviously people didn't vote to not know of GMOs in their food. Now they're going to tell you the voting machines voted to take your guns away. They're going to tell you the voting machines voted for a national draft. They're going to tell you the voting machines voted that you want to jump on top of razor blades, you know, and cut your nose off and jump in a tank of alcohol. It's all pure, absolute, unmitigated garbage. And the fact that we can now can switch from studio to studio and talk to Gerald Salente when he was in Ireland and do it all and have 230 plus thousand people tuned in that night on the video streams, not to mention, I didn't get the numbers on the audio streams. I bet those were in the hundreds and hundreds of thousands like our podcast is. I mean, again, that's not when I was even on terrestrial radio broadcasting to millions. That is exciting. That is incredibly good news. I know I've already, I know I've already told you about that. You know what? Let's, let's while he's editing that, not that I can't just keep talking forever. Let's go play because it's so funny. The Dan Badandi, John Baum piece that Baum put together of them as zombies. Uh, I forget the exact name of it. If not, it's on YouTube. Uh, and uh, we'll play that and a couple more, a uh, couple more pieces here for you. And then I'm gonna go home and see my kids for about an hour or two and go to sleep. I'm gonna get some early, uh, early shut out. I get up about 10 o'clock tonight because uh, I've already seen strategic relocation. Uh, if you go to YouTube, uh, the, uh, if you can't find it in our computers, the name of it is something like uh, something like uh, Infowars. Infowars attack by zombies was not one name. Alex Jones attack by zombies was the other shorter one. And then the one with them, uh, type in zombies. Oh, you, oh, you already had it? Well then, well then play that. Yeah, but, but it's the one, but there it is, zombies attack, hidden camera, that's the one we want. It's zombies attack, hidden camera, do you have that one? Yeah, yeah, play them both back to back, and then folks, to call your friends and family. Because, hey, if we can just fire this up and have millions on Justin TV when we do that or fire it up and have, you know, a quarter million or close to it watching, just keep paying it forward. Keep spreading the word. Keep getting more people because we're going to beat these globalists. And, and just wait to hear the people in denial about the globalists wanting our guns. Uh, so that is coming up. You guys ready to roll that? All right. Uh, I'll be back in the taped dimension. Um, how long is it, dude? Have you figured out how long it is with the film tonight? Four hours? Okay, I'm sorry. It's a five-hour transmission coming up. Yeah, and the wild horses could not pull the team away. So special reports, all of it, five hours. You want it, you got it. Uh, bye, guys. Uh, here is the uh, Loving Zombies. Alex Jones here reporting on a virtual army of out-of-control, zombified, yuppie sheeple marching around everywhere chanting mainstream media slogans. We're here reporting on this epidemic that is spreading and the mass murder of psyche and critical thinking. Help us! A worldwide phenomenon of trendies becoming more and more mindless and being in zombie-like trance states, worshiping mainstream media, American oh Idol, and Justin Bieber. Right. Is there any way to awaken them? Is there any cure to this virtual madness, the mass murder of the mind and critical thinking? Second Amendment bad. <laughs> you poor zombie here. You need this. Is there any hope? Tune in next time. Can we cure the zombies? The presentation you have just witnessed is a test. Are you conscious? Are you aware that you are being manipulated? Or have you descended into a dreamlike zombie state that much of the public is suffering from? In the power-packed November issue of InfoWars magazine, 
We detail with the scientific facts in four separate articles the proof that the public is being brainwashed. Our brainwaves are lowering, our IQs are dropping, and we are being turned into nothing more than biological androids. You can buy copies of InfoWars magazine at cost in bundles of 10 up to 100 and give them to your friends and family. It's time to shake humanity out of the trance that they're in. And the November issue of InfoWars magazine is designed to do just that. Sign up for a subscription or secure copies at cost in bulk today at InfoWarsStore.com.